Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office, which is currently the ninth largest sheriff's office in the country, comprises and enforces in an area of Palm Beach County, roughly 2,300 square miles, and we service about 1.6 million residents. The Sheriff's Office currently maintains a reserve and auxiliary unit, which is staffed by about 60 deputies um, in various units. Most of our auxiliary and reserve deputies work for the Sheriff's Office currently in a civilian capacity. They are retired Sheriff's Office or other law enforcement officers who bring their subject matter um, expertise back to the agency. We have business professionals that work for the Sheriff's Office, such as doctors, attorneys, uh, funeral directors, FPL team members. We also have deputy sheriffs that are fresh out of the academy that are looking to get hired by the Sheriff's Office. One Alpha two nine, an armed robbery to a business just occurred with possible shots fired. One Alpha two nine. Individuals who want to work for the Sheriff's Office as a reserve deputy or auxiliary officer have many different opportunities to serve the agency, not just in capacity of road patrol. Uh, the deputies serve in our Marine unit. Now our Marine unit not only patrols the waterways, the coastal areas, but they also patrol the natural areas of the Sheriff's Office. All these boats are utilized for the protection of the county and our reserve and auxiliary officers are involved with using those boats. And our wildlands unit, which has very large vehicles, four-wheel drive, off-road vehicles, swamp buggies and airboats as well so that they can patrol the natural areas. They also were assigned to our drone unit, so they have vehicles assigned to them, they have drones that are assigned to them, and they'll go out and they'll supplement the um, full-time deputies when they're called out for uh, SWAT call-outs, surveillance, uh, stakeouts, anything of that nature. Uh, we also have deputies that are assigned to our SWAT team that are actual SWAT medics. Now these SWAT medics are full-time employees of Palm Beach County Fire Rescue and they're also sworn law enforcement officers so they could take law enforcement action in the event um, during a SWAT operation they need to do so. Uh, we also have deputies that are assigned to our SWAT technician program. We also have deputies that are assigned to our special projects unit for the sheriff, deputies that are assigned to our bicycle unit that maintain our fleet of bicycles. The reserve and auxiliary unit also works in partnership with the sheriff's office mounted unit. We also have deputies that are assigned to our emergency field force, uh, which is a large field force that conducts various operations such as search and rescue, peacekeeping, uh, also dignitary protection on a wide scale. The Sheriff's Office SWAT team and emergency field force, along with many members of our reserve and auxiliary unit, were tasked with the protection of the President of the United States during the time that he stayed in Palm Beach County and any of the visiting dignitaries that came to see uh, President Trump. The reserve and auxiliary unit Supplement our road patrol deputies. NCIC person clear. Sergeant NCIC Fetter conducts road patrol operation NCIC for the reserve clear. unit. Sergeant Fetter is one of our auxiliary officers. Good morning, how you doing? Good morning. Fetter, nice to meet you, podiatry. David Fetter serves full time as a doctor. I do practice as a doctor during the day. Um, when I was a little kid, I was always interested in law enforcement. I had a couple of friends who became police officers. I always had an interest, kept friendly with them, and then, unfortunately, 9-11, a couple of uh, people in my high school who were police officers and firefighters were killed, and uh, I always wanted to serve. I never really had the chance to serve, so finally, when my kids got a little older in 2010, I went to the police academy and then uh, joined the sheriff's office. He also, additionally, is a SWAT coordinator for the technician program. Expired tag, NCIC clear. Peter Manfredi who is also a sergeant with our reserve and auxiliary unit, conducts road patrol operation. And when he's not working with the sheriff's office, he's actually a funeral director in South Miami. My regular job, I work as a manager for a funeral home. I manage the funeral home and our care center where we do the preparation of the remains. I've always had an interest in law enforcement and starting from high school years, everyone said, oh, it's too dangerous, don't do it. Um, about 10 years ago, I decided that the law enforcement bug had bitten again and decided to go to the academy and get involved with a law enforcement career. Getting the ability to play cops and robbers as an adult. And uh, it's fun, there's a lot of satisfaction in that and being able to, to have a positive outcome. Detective Mary Olson is a retired law enforcement officer from the Delray Beach Police Department as well as the West Palm Beach Police Department. As my regular job, I investigate sober homes and treatment facilities. It's uh, money laundering, insurance fraud, those kinds of cases. 
And then what I volunteer is the ancillary stuff that I do for people that are also involved in recovery. I try to find them better places. We try to get kids or young adults back home when they've had uh, a problem with the treatment facilities that they have been going to. Reserve deputies for the sheriff's office must attend the same police academy that any other law enforcement officer in the state of Florida has to attend. Once this is completed, the deputy will start an in-house training program. The auxiliary deputy attends a abbreviated academy. They'll attend the same in-house training as a standard deputy sheriff would. Once they are working in tandem and working at the direction of that reserve deputy, that full-time deputy or supervisor, these auxiliary officers have full policing powers. Our reserve and auxiliary officers do not get paid with money. The intrinsic value of serving the, the agency is enough for our folks. It's not about the, the, the pay. I do it because of the satisfaction of helping people and really helping the community that I live in. Again, I've had the interest in law enforcement. Uh, this gives me the ability to, to do that while doing my, my regular career um, and still give something back to the community. I actually tried to retire for six months and found that I got bored very quickly. And you can only shop so much, uh, travel so much and then you realize you still have more to offer a community and an agency and that's why I came back. The Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office is truly one of the finest law enforcement agencies in this country. If you're interested in becoming a member of the Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office Reserve and Auxiliary Program, please contact the Sheriff's Office at 561-688-3000 or visit our website at www.pbso.org.